Welcome back to another episode of Roger and me digging into Roger. Now, in the previous episode, actually, I don't want to talk about the previous episode because it was in this episode, <laughs> I'm going to continue rebuilding that back section, which in the previous episode, I just cut most of it out. Now, there's six panels that I made in the previous episode, and I've got another probably one or two to make. Yeah, I'm just going to, I'm just going to do it. Now, as you can see, there's no sill left. There's no dog bone area left. All this is now gone um, because I've had to cut it all out because it was just all rusty. Now, in the previous episode, like I mentioned, I made some panels. There's like six panels down here that I've made. Um, so I can start getting these panels welded into here, um, but I also need to take this little situation into consideration, cut this out, put this on the new section that I've made. But I also need to make this section here as well and then obviously do something with this which is going to be a pain.
Right, so the situation is, I've got all these panels spot welded on. Now this is just so I, I know everything works, I know all the overlaps work, etc. These will come off um, once I do get this inside section done. Um, now, offering this section up, which is the old sort of corner, this fits quite nicely with all of this, so I'm happy with that. Now, what I need to do now is I need to start on this inside section here. Um, so it goes from, from here, and then it ends up coming into this sort of corner on this section here. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spot weld this on just for now, or tack it on, just so I know exactly where this edge is, and I can get a piece of paper and just trace out exactly how big the panel is, and then I can start making that panel. So I've made this piece, it's quite a complex, it doesn't look complex, but it is quite a complex piece because it's got a lot of sort of shapes and angles going on. Um, now, I popped this on just so I know exactly where this edge um, lies, and then I can obviously bend this round. So this actually laps inside there. Um, now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop this in, clamp it from the backside inside the boot, and then I'm gonna spot it together just temporarily, and then I can take this and to that section out there, and then obviously weld it together properly and treat it properly. And then that'll be one big section that I can then pop in there and get it, get it all welded back in. Right, so I've welded these together, um, so this actually follows the contour of this inner section here. 
Now I've tacked these on but I need to take these back off so then clean that inner section and then I can weld everything back on. Right, so I've got this welded in, well, tacked in, um, spot welded in. Um, now I've still got a little bit of work to do up here. I've got a bit of joining to do. I've got a little bit, um, you know, bits and bobs to do, um, but that's the main uh, part of it in. Now this here, this actually, like I said before, this tucks into this corner, this corner that is now non-existent on this panel. Um, but if I was to place that there, that then kind of starts to make a bit more sense. Um, so. I need to remake this and obviously make sure it tucks in there, but make sure it follows the normal contour that this one does to make sure that that arch is perfect. Now that's all sorted. That's all we've got time for in this video. Do catch us in the next video on Auto Alex's car, where we're going to continue on this section. We're hopefully gonna make this little piece here that's probably gonna be a pain. Um, and then hopefully we're gonna get onto that little, well, it's not little, there's a huge hole there, but hopefully we're gonna get onto that section over there.